What are the four types of malaria? An in-depth exploration for medical students and healthcare professionals. Question, what is the most deadly species of Plasmodium responsible for malaria? Answer, Plasmodium falciparum is the most dangerous type and is responsible for the majority of malaria-related deaths worldwide. Question, which Plasmodium species causes tertian fever in malaria? Answer, Plasmodium vivax and Plasmodium oval cause tertian fever, with symptoms recurring every other day. Question, which type of malaria can remain dormant in the liver for extended periods? Answer, Plasmodium vivax can remain dormant in the liver and can relapse years after the initial infection. Question, what is unique about the life cycle of Plasmodium malariae? Answer, Plasmodium malariae has a three-day life cycle, causing quartan fever with symptoms recurring every third day. Question, how is Plasmodium oval typically diagnosed? Answer, Plasmodium oval is typically diagnosed through microscopic examination of blood films, as well as rapid diagnostic tests. Question, which Plasmodium species is most common in Sub-Saharan Africa? Answer, Plasmodium falciparum is most common in Sub-Saharan Africa. Question, how are the different types of Plasmodium transmitted? Answer, all four types of Plasmodium are transmitted through the bite of an infected female Anopheles mosquito. Question, what are some common prevention methods for malaria? Answer, prevention methods include mosquito netting, insect repellent, proper clothing, and anti-malarial medications. Question, what are the typical symptoms of a malaria infection? Answer, typical symptoms include fever, chills, sweating, headaches, nausea, body aches, and in severe cases, coma or death. Question, which type of malaria is known for its prolonged incubation period? Answer, Plasmodium malariae has a prolonged incubation period, often taking weeks to manifest symptoms. Question, how does resistance to anti-malarial drugs impact the treatment of malaria? Answer, resistance, especially in Plasmodium falciparum, can make treatment more difficult, necessitating the use of combination therapies. Question, what are the key complications of malaria? Answer, complications include anemia, respiratory distress, cerebral malaria, kidney failure, and death. Further information. To explore more details, statistics, and medical insights into the types of malaria, please refer to reputable sources such as the World Health Organization, WHO, or Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, CDC, websites.